Hey guys, I'm Ash, licensed instructor of Ely Chen, the martial art of awareness, and uh, it's getting to be pretty hot here in Arizona right now. Anyway, today's just a quick video update. I have a little something that I'm really excited about that I want to share with you guys. Um, this is uh, the beginning of June, and uh, starting on Tuesday, uh, this issue of Kung Fu Tai Chi magazine is going to be available on the newsstand, so you'll be able to find it in bookstores across the U.S. And it has uh, my article in there. It's my first time in print, so I hope you guys will check that out. The title is called um, Finding the Center. It's about the three essential qualities of uh, Yi Li Chuan being able to manifest uh, what we call the, like, uh, the spherical energy of offense and defense. Um, and, and it's uh, basically it's about offense and defense as one on the, on the point of contact how you can be able to generate that spherical energy, right, that in a lot of Chinese martial arts they talk about is the Peng energy. Uh, you know, you want to be able to have that point of contact act as a sphere that no matter how you touch, I keep you out. And so my article talks about uh, what my Sifu, Grandmaster Sam F.S. Chen, how he talks about the three qualities of engagement as the circle to center, center to center, center with cross, right? So how uh, you create a point of contact that always generates some energy to the center of the sphere and how you link uh, the multiple spheres from the point of contact through all the different joints from the center of the point of contact through the center of all the joints and then the center with the cross of how you match a cross from the sphere on the point of contact and how that matches up to the crosses uh, on your partner so it would be the mass, the joints and uh, down to the center of the feet so that you can get the qualities of being able to uh, establish a, a diameter line that always keeps your partner uh, from being able to strike you and then with the cross how you can control to be able to feed and lead the right energy that you can uh, always control the balance from the point of contact so that you can control the hands, control the body, control the feet. And so the, um, the article that is in uh, this upcoming issue of Kung Fu Tai Chi magazine uh, is adapted from a discussion that uh, Sifu gave um, in LA uh, a few years back and I was there for that one and I recorded that one and I boiled it down into a nice article. It's got some good photos in there. We're on page 42. Uh, so again, I hope you guys have checked it out. I'm really excited about it. My first time in print. And I'll put a, a, a link, a direct link in the video description below so that you guys can go to be able to purchase the, the digital uh, edition. If you guys don't have a subscription, if you have a subscription, uh, you guys should already be getting those in the mail. Um, otherwise, for things coming up, uh, I want you guys to watch my channel, please. Um, start, I leave on Wednesday, Tuesday, this coming Tuesday. So I got like four more days here in the U.S. and then I leave uh, for Europe. So I'm going to be over there first. Some, we have the one week camp coming up in Slovakia, the retreat. So we're going to be out there in the mountains. We're going to be training for, uh, I'll be out there for 10 days training. The, the camp is going to run for seven. And uh, I'm going to bring you guys a whole bunch of um, video updates from there and so I hope you guys will check those out and enjoy those. We're going to talk about the camp and show some of the different things, the setup and the talk about the training. Again, like how I did with Tucson, I'm, I'm trying to uh, interview different people who are there training, get some of their feedback and so you guys can uh, see kind of how other people's opinions of what we're doing out there. And then uh, from there, then I go to Norway and I'm going to be teaching a weekend workshop in Norway. I'll be in Norway for uh, I think like five days total and then I come back. So anyway, so I hope in the next two weeks it's going to depend on the internet connection, especially out in the mountains in, um, in Slovakia. We are we're supposed to have uh, a Wi-Fi connection out there, but it's not always going to be the best. So I have, probably have to keep my videos a little bit shorter, but I hope you guys will watch them. I hope you enjoy them. I'm really excited about some of these things that we got coming up. And then after I get back, I'm going to start to share some things with you guys about my upcoming plans for the, the permaculture farm or retreat center that I'm going to be developing in New York uh, that I hope you guys will come out and train out there too. 
And, uh, and other than that, I think that's it for now. So train hard, stay strong. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.